Good morning, everybody. It is uh, Sunday. The time goes forward, march forward, fall back. We go forward in an hour. Oh, I always hate this angle. It's always crazy. We lose an hour, we gain an hour. I don't know. I am going to CVS to pick up medicine for Ryder because he doesn't feel good. Friday night, he was like coughing. Like the only way I could just, he don't have, I know he doesn't have whooping cough, but it sounded like that whooping cough. And I think it's because you know, when you're congested or you have like a lot of uh, mucus and stuff like that, it's just like, it's stuck and stuff. So he had a lot of that coughing going on overnight. And then in the morning, he wasn't that bad during the day. Like he was, he was cool during the day. It was like random coughs here and there. And then like his nose was like a little bit like runny, but it wasn't crazy. And then he didn't have fever. But last night when we got home, that was just like 10 times worse. So like his cough was crazy all night. And then he was like, not really sneezing as much, but it was it was a runny nose. It took his temperature and he had a fever. So it was like at 99 and then I took it again like two hours later and it was like at 100. And then this morning it was like at 101. So I'm gonna go and get him a Tylenol or Motrin. I'm not sure, one of those two. The doctor told me that they have chewables for the kids. I had plans today to go to a friend's house for like a barbecue and stuff, but it's supposed to be nice because it is nice right now but if he doesn't feel good after i give him the medicine i'm just gonna stay home anyway guys all right i'm gonna see y'all we're on our way out the door but before we go i wanted to show y'all something really quick so this is what happens when you leave Ryder in a room by himself yes okay this is what happens when you leave this child by himself like it honestly makes it makes no sense. Uh, we're on our way out the door. Ryder actually has a doctor's Mommy. appointment. Where's my jacket? I think it's gone. I think my jacket is gone. Jacket I hope gone. it's not gone. The jacket gone. I know. Where's the jacket? Come on. Get your toys. I'm gonna get your backpack, okay? Yes. Okay, so Ryder has a bone doctor appointment. Oh, did I bring it? Yeah, so he has a bone doctor appointment. Mom, he messed up his like, hello. okay, say hello. Mom, hello. Say hello. Hey. Okay. So he has a bone doctor appointment that I have to take him to because uh, a couple weeks ago, probably like maybe a month ago or over a little over a month, he messed up his clavicle. I think that's what you call it. I don't know, this bone that's right here that you can't see on me because my ass is pregnant and fat. We've tried like a few like slings. There's a really good sling that is like Velcro and if he didn't take it off, it probably would work, but he unvelcros it so it doesn't really do what it's supposed to do because he takes his arms out. But it's a really good one. I don't like the one that they give you because it do, it's not it doesn't do anything for your kids. I'll show you guys when we get back home. And then he has one for around the shoulder. So um, it's like the way you wear a backpack. So it's like over, around his shoulder and his arm and stuff. So he can't move his shoulder. So he stays like that. Okay. So but, Hi. I like this mommy. Your mommy. Hi. Okay, sit, please. It's mommy. Your mommy. You can put your mommy. And your hey. It's mommy. Your mommy. Hey, I'll be your mommy. What did you buy me? I need your mommy. Mom. Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. Happy to be. Oh, you're so close. Hello? Mom? Pancake? Yes, yeah, a little okay. pancake. Okay. Uh-uh, you're gonna break it. Give me. I'm taking... Let me see that. Hello, see. Oh, hello. Hi. What's that? Let me 
see. We are at the grocery store. No, no balloon. Why the grocery store? Yeah. Because Sean wants a shrimp burrito for dinner. So I picked up a red onion, but I picked up a really big one because I think I'm gonna make myself a quesadilla. I think so. So I'm gonna get this wrap. He wants a wheat wrap, but they only have whole wheat. This is what they got. They don't got wheat, they got whole wheat. Boop. Let me see, this brings. How many? Oh, eight. That's enough. I'm gonna show you. I'm like breathing. I'm so out of breath. I'm gonna show you real quick because I was trying to show you on this store, but I couldn't because shopping with dollars. That's how they go. Picked up two cucumbers. They were like four for five, but I just picked up two. Oh, uh, wheat wrap for Sean. I picked up some more paella rice. My favorite. I need a garlic powder. Didn't have any. Um, I got pico de gallo and it has the guac on the bottom. I got one red onion, Mexican blend cheese, and garlic salt. And I used my recyclable bag, guys. I used it. So I'm about to make, about to take out the sushi, about to take out shrimp, defrost it, and I start cooking. I'm gonna make me a shrimp quesadilla anyway all right i'm gonna see y'all riders upstairs playing with the ground i'm gonna make them some chicken and fries and i'm gonna start dinner for us so see you then. what is up guys it is uh, today's friday and i'm on my way to wally world and target and probably dollar general to find a toilet tissue i also need some cleaning supplies because we are out of specific ones so we need we need some and then I need, I think I have Tylenol home so I'll be good. And the kids, they have their medicine and so does Sean. And I need to go grocery shopping because my ass waited two weeks to go grocery shopping. So I hope that the grocery store has the things that we need because I'm gonna be stressed out if it doesn't because we need food in the house. I tried to do online at Target because I always order online and then I do like the um, drive up. I tried to order some things online and guess what, they don't have anything in stock that I need and then when you click like to put it in your cart that it does have in stock you're not allowed to do like pickup option so we'll see in the store what they have and what they don't have and then when Sean gets out of work we're gonna go grocery shopping it is 75 degrees outside guys 75 degrees but we're gonna see you in the store we're in Target oh, let me show you this gone and it says it's limiting people look at this shit craziness like this is insane what like all the lights all and shit is like gone like what the frig i do need some laundry detergent though look at this i've never seen this you guys ever seen this one let me let you see the sign real quick <laughs> car we're waiting for Sean right we just got out of a giant and the lines are like insane I don't want to say that they're really bad because they're not really bad they're just like really long and like people's carts aren't as big as ours they're going by really fast so like we were in the line maybe like I want to say 10 minutes waiting and people were looking at the lines like going in and like saying oh my god we're gonna be here for like an hour and i really wasn't in line for that long like they're really going really fast like people there's really not much in the stores to buy so people's carts aren't really that filled they don't have any water they don't have any eggs like bread aisle is damn near gone frozen foods canned foods pasta there's no pasta no pasta no pasta sauce cleaning supplies like anything you can think of they're all out of it there's no toilet tissue anywhere absolutely no toilet tissue so i had to buy another package of wipes and then they sell wipes that you could flush down the toilet so i bought a box of those 
and I'm thinking I maybe should have bought two because we use wipes a lot in my house. Like we use wipes more than we use, you know, toilet tissue. We went through self checkout and after each customer was done at their self checkout, they were spraying and wiping down everything. And they had gloves on. Like people are out here shopping with gloves on. I didn't see anybody with masks, but I seen people shopping with gloves on their hands like crazy. My son's school, like his school, he just told me today like his school has two weeks off. Then like a lot of places are gonna have like you know two weeks off and then they oh yeah I got an email that said they don't know how long after the two weeks that if they can or cannot come back to school it's craziness like let's not panic by like you guys are buying like why y'all buying all the eggs in real life without a crisis are you really eating all those eggs so most of those eggs are gonna go to waste in your home like y'all buying like 10 eggs are you really gonna have those 10 eggs in two two weeks you're gonna eat all those 10 boxes of eggs bro like no you're not like come on there's no waters all right waters i understand waters go really fast even on regular but like there's nothing like why are we panic buying let's just be clean let's just clean up after ourselves and not be pigs let's slow it down anyway i will <laughs>